What's going on everyone and welcome back to Minion Simulator where today we're going to be checking out this massive update, update number 40 from Minion Simulator. We have the added bags, added multi pickaxe, added titanic minions, oh my gosh, new exclusives, new boss minion, what? Improved luck, new pets, new realm, new zone, new currency, oh my god, everything, everything is here, I can't wait. A few hours later. The exclusive chests are here and everyone was happy to see this but the odds, the odds on the Titanic were insane, especially on a game that doesn't have so many buyers to begin with. So what they did was they changed it and made it to 0.5% just like every other huge. But the problem is that a change like this occurred 2 hours after the update was out. So a lot of people bought chests and just got nothing. But not to worry because we have good news to share with you guys. Because SV Yoshi said this, anyone who purchased anything before 1pm CDT on update day will be compensated we don't know how we don't know what they're gonna do but they're gonna figure it out the devs are i think they're like burnt out so i'm gonna be patient and i hope you guys can be patient as well to let them sort things out this is a massive update but yeah it's just so big that they tried to do so much and couldn't do it i opened 56 chests i didn't get the titanic any huge and no lightning exclusives that's a major major loss that's a big fat l for me but what can i do what can I possibly do more than this? I know that if I don't hatch a Titanic myself, I will never be able to afford one myself. I know that. This is what it looks like. Look at the difference in size compared to the avatar. That's what it looks like. I know I can't afford it. So what can I do? I have to wait for maybe a month or two months when it becomes very cheap. If it becomes cheap. That's all I can think about. Let's move on to the bag because look at my gold. 12 million gold is what I have. Keep in mind that I'm a player that used to spend 200 to 300,000 Robux only selling game passes. I have two people that really helped out to sell game passes and I can't do that anymore because no one buys game passes anymore. No one. It is so difficult for me to gain gold in this game that looking at the 5 million, <laughs> looking at the 5 million gold, I'm thinking to myself, I can't afford it, but I have to do it for a video. That's how sad things are now. Like, that is so, so sad. But I did it. I had to do it. I did it and I got the back tier one just for this video. And look at my gold. Oh my god. <laughs> also, another thing that I have to expose is my inventory. Because if you look at some of my pets, I actually have pets that don't have pickaxes. Yep, I know, I know. I need to work on that. And I definitely will now with the upgraded pickaxes that they have in today's update. In terms of interest, it's something that they're planning on doing in the future. But right now, we don't have anything or any news to share with you guys. Now, for the boss minion though, what is this? What the heck is this? This looks epic. It looks epic. It's always the boss minions that look much better than the, their exclusive pets. Maybe except the Titanic. The Titanic, the Knight Phantom looks epic. We're not gonna afford it, you can't get it, but still, it looks epic. It's an awesome pet to have, but you can't get it. You just can't get it. You have to be extremely lucky in order to get it. You have to be as lucky as this person. But look at this. Look at the date when I took the screenshot and look at the time. It's 12 hours past and only one person hatched one. That is crazy. There's a lot of problems with this. I hope that they work on this soon enough because if you just add those numbers up, it's a total of 100.3%. I don't remember it being that way. From how much they keep on changing this boss minion, the odds for this, I can't keep up. Hopefully they change that in the future. This boss minion looks awesome. And guys, I have a theory. I have a theory in my head just to like tell me Maybe this is a possibility in order to get these free to play huges. Maybe it works out. And if it does, I promise you guys, you're going to be the first to know. I'm currently going to test it out. I'm going to have that account set up and I'm going to see if it actually works. Because if I'm right, it changes everything the way you play this game entirely. Moving on to the pets, this is the weird looking villager 40.5T as a golden. And then let's see what it looks like as a rainbow or what it is as a rainbow. 
93.5 trillion as a rainbow helps out a lot of new players 281 trillion as the dark matter version but although once you reach to this level once you reach to this area you probably don't need these anymore so this is just basically there 121 t as a rainbow and then as a dark matter it's 361 i love the way that this pet is designed this guy is designed and then this one here is the rare pet 108 trillion as a golden version it has a weird name village princess like when you see village and then princess they just don't go together 748 trillion as a dark matter and even though that even if you reach this level in this stage to get to the fantasy world once you reach there you're not going to use these pets yourself but you still can sell them on the trading plaza and get gold and that's what people do they get as many of these as possible and then they go and sell them to people who just maybe started playing the game and know how to farm gold in the trading plaza and it's a big money maker this is how you make money in the game there's no other way for you to gain gold except to try to get to the top and get those pets sell them in the trading plaza and that's it you have to keep on repeating this process and hopefully it works out for you now we skipped a bunch we got the the epic the dark matter that i skipped 6.75 q for this and i don't usually rename these normal minions but in this case this dark matter will be given a name i'm just gonna call it annie it's gonna be changed to annie anytime soon because it looks like an annie that's the dark matter legendary and the next up we got the secret pet which looks awesome i thought this was gonna be a huge and i kept saying i'm gonna be so disappointed if this isn't a huge and it ends up being a normal minion but once I saw the huge and the titanic, I can shut up because those look much, much better than this. I'm so glad that this is a secret. 15.8Q is the lightning gold version, and that is pretty good. As a rainbow, 14.7Q. That is ridiculous, but I didn't use this in order to make it into a dark matter. What I did is I had this one. I bought this one for so, so cheap. On day one that it was released, I bought it for like 18 million. I don't know how. But I made it into a dark matter using Robux because that's the cheapest way for me to do it. And I got this. It looks gorgeous. But there's a visual glitch on it where it just appears as golden. So if you see something like this on the trade, look to make sure that it says secret. And then below it says dark matter. That's how you know that it's definitely a dark matter pet. And that is awesome. 43.6 Q for this is ridiculously awesome. It jumped my score to 71.7 Q. Here is where you get the pin, I was struggling to look for it, but if you go to the boss minion, there's a giant tower, behind the tower is this pin, but make sure to see your inventory, make sure record it, do whatever you want to prepare, because most likely you will not get the plus 5 storage, you have to send a ticket and support on their discord, and then they will do it for you. That seems to be the case all the time, and they just can't fix it, maybe it's just a bad code. Moving on to the next part, we got the pickaxe machine, which finally, finally looks really awesome. It looks so good that it finally fits my screen. I can see all the pickaxes, and not only that, but I can pick multiple huges, only up to three huges, and then I have to go on the left side, pick which pickaxe I want, definitely the elder pickaxe, definitely the molten pickaxe, Maybe let's do that for now, see how quick this happens, because the luck for this is really, it's, sometimes it's really tough to get. But once you pick the huges, pick which pickaxe you want, you have to click on the auto and then on the upgrade and let the magic happen. Now I'm not going to bore you guys throughout the entire process, but I did add the legendary just to see if it's going to be a quicker process, just to see what happens. So once that was done, it dropped. This is 10,000 gold per spin for both of them. It's gonna keep on continuing until one of them get either of those pickaxes on the left of my screen. Had to edit this entire process, finally got it in there, and I didn't continue on this one. I just had to stop, there's just so much. The secret pickaxe, it's so impossible. It's so, so tough to get, but it actually does add score in your total score for the for leaderboards, especially if you're a competing player, you would want to have the secret pickaxe. But if not, then the mythic is good as it is. Not the legendary though, you might as well just aim for the molten pickaxe. It's gonna take some time, a lot of time, but right now it is much easier. Imagine the people that did this for all that time. Finally, it has been perfected, and that's great news for us. And that's the end of today's video, everyone. Tomorrow I'm gonna show you guys what I hatched and what I got, because I hatched too much. I'm gonna tell you guys how much I spent, what I hatched exactly, and all the details will be there. I'm so glad I don't have a podium position anymore, and I hope that it stays that way. 
But for today's video, everyone, if you want a chance to get that Mythic Game Pass, because you're gonna need it for the next update next week, of course, if you don't already have one, all you have to do is put your Roblox username down in the comments down below, also, make sure to like this video and be a subscriber because there's a way for me to check that. If you don't do that, then you won't be eligible to win and you win a Game Pass that's worth $16.99 Robux. That's all for today's video, everyone. I really hope that you enjoyed that. If you did, it would mean a lot to me if you can leave a like down below. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so. That would mean so much more. I hope that you guys have a wonderful day or evening wherever you are in the world and I'll see you all on the next one.